Let's see how this works. This circuit is called a clamper circuit. Its purpose in life is to take an AC input waveform, like so, and with that centered around zero volts, like so, it's an AC voltage, and turn it into a DC voltage that might have a 0.87 volt below the uh, zero volt threshold. So what it effectively does is take this whole waveform and shake it up. The circuit, what we've added to it is a capacitor here, and we have a diode and a resistor. Very simple circuit. But let's see if we can figure out how it accomplishes this. Um, <clears throat> on the positive half of the waveform, we have plus here, minus here. We have the cap, we have current path this way, this way, and back. The cap doesn't charge. It has a, um, what you do to one side of the cap happens to the other. So if you increase the voltage here, you will also increase the voltage here. So RL has a voltage across it. We have current through it. Um, that didn't help us much. What about if, let's redraw this circuit to make it less complicated. <laughs> and like that. Okay, put the diode in correctly this time. Um, what about when? We have positive is here. Well, what on earth is going on? Positive here, negative here. We have a possibility of current up here. This cap is held negative on this side, actually negative on this side and positive on this side. Um, and the cap charges. To the peak, whatever this is, uh, minus 0.7 volts. So the cap charges to the peak minus 0.7 volts. Okay, not a problem. So let's go back to this circuit here, we'll do it in green this time. And now we have positive here, negative here. We still have this. We haven't discharged this cap yet. So we have positive here and a negative here. That makes it look like there are batteries in series. This one is charged essentially to V peak. This one is at V peak of plus and negative, so this is to V peak right here. That gets us, um, frankly, it gets us all the way up to 2 V peak. Let's try that again. Minus 0.7 volts. Huh. So now we're up here. And what happens to it when this voltage goes back to this condition here? When it gets back to this condition here, this cap is still charged with plus here and minus here. Um, that makes it look like a set of batteries like that, and they cancel. Except for we have a V peak minus a V peak 
at minus 0.7 volts. So what happens is this reaches through down here to minus 0.7 volts, and then it increases again. Minus 0.7 volts increases again. So this is 2V peak minus 0.7 volts. That's minus 0.7. Minus 0.7 to the peak minus 0.7 volts. Very interesting circuit.